Terry McPhillips, one place to start. It's been described as a groundbreaking day yesterday for Blackpool Football Club. From the manager and your perspective, what have you made of the last 24 hours? Um, hard to fathom it all out in terms of, you know, don't really know what's happening. You know, need it explaining properly to me. Um, but we will just get on with it. You know, the players will be in and we'll have a meeting and we'll talk about it. We'll tell them what we know, which isn't a lot. And, uh, and we'll go training and get prepared for the challenge. Is it a concerning time for you and the players, bearing in mind you, you're in a little bit of uncertainty at the moment, or maybe more than a little bit? I think there's a little bit of limbo, you know, um, in terms of points deduction and stuff like that, so I think I'm sure the players will want to know, you know, we all want to know and the supporters will want to know about that. Um, hopefully that doesn't happen. Um, and, and really from where we are this morning, it's, it's like we'll just have to see how it goes and, and hopefully get informed. Are you expecting, Terry, somebody to walk through the door today and say, we're the receivers, we're running the football club until further notice? I'm expecting a phone call at least, you know, um, whether they come in today or tomorrow or Monday remains to be seen. We'll find out soon, I'm sure. Um, but as I say, we'll just, uh, when that call comes or that knock on the door, we'll, we'll have a meeting and we'll crack on from there. Is there a thought in your mind that the next home game, there might be so many more people through the gates and is that quite exciting? Well, you know, the thought of Bloomfield being really packed out, like, you know, we've just gone to Sundal and Portsmouth away and stuff like that, and to have a big crowd here to cheer us on, you know, I thought the crowd at Sunderland was superb for us. Um, so, yeah, that is really exciting, yeah. In terms of matters on the pitch, how pleased are you with, with the way the players uh, are going about it at the moment? Very well, you know, good. Um, disappointing on Tuesday, it felt like a loss to me and I know, I know the players after the game were disappointed so you know we, we really thought we should have got a penalty at 1-0 and if we score it it were 2-0 and we got a great chance of winning the game so um, but in general you know the, the boys are doing ever so well I think we're six unbeaten we kept four clean sheets in that and um, we've just got to keep going. What sort of game are you expecting this weekend at the bye? <clears throat> Hard game, like they all are, they, but they play football. They watched them at Fleetwood there when we got the Atkinson game called off a week or so ago. And um, they play football, play a diamond, um, two up front. I expect a harder game than they give Fleetwood because um, they'll be at home. And uh, they've got some good players, that's for sure. And uh, But we'll go down there and give them a match.